Delta to say we're still joined by one of Britain's best loved and respected actresses. Don't stop clapping. It's Emma Thompson. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Chatting about obviously your your reworking of um, you know Peter Rabbit and Sense and Sensibility and and wearing a bonnet and being sensible. You 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 in a film at the moment. You've been filming with Piers Brosnan. Is that right? Yeah. Well, someone's got to do it. Yeah. Yes. Oh. And have you been sensible in that? Oh no 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 no. Good. No 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 Good. no no. No, no, no. no bonnets. No. Stunt stunt driving in Paris. Great. Wow. You know driving down steps and with Piers in the other seat going stop it stop it don't do that you've got up one you've got up one I was supposed to stay on four steps and the car went up so we were going like that he thought oh, we're going to go we're going to go over and it's you know it's quite funny because I'm driving Do you have your own stuff? <laughs> really? You're I'm driving, driving. I'm driving? driving yeah oh my goodness Hysterical. what fun it's a divorced couple who are who go to steal a diamond in order to deal with the fact that their company's been bought by a hedge fund and, and the pensions right. have all got so it's about the crash really mm. but they and during the Film, they get back together, sort of. And thing. do you have to film any kind of things? <laughs> 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 and I get not sexy. <laughs> we had a couple joke. of days where we did have to snog. Oh, okay. Ooh, really? So I was tasting my breath. I had to snog Pierce all day. Oh, no, really why? tough. Oh, really. <laughs> <laughs> So hard. I don't know. Oh, I don't know whether I can quite carry on with this. Yeah, but, <laughs> um, it's been you know. beautiful, though. Yes. Oh, yes. Because you can get to go home. I can't have him then. as well. <laughs> you know, that's, I'm, that's what I'm saying. Um, but and then I had to take all my clothes off, which I haven't had to do for some time, actually. The first time I had to do it was with Jeff Goldblum and the, the tall guy. guy. Oh, love my favourite. Love it. Love it. Love well, it. The, and the campaign against pornography chose that sex scene as the one they would show their children if because it's, right. it's got, funny. Because yeah. it's funny yeah. and it's sort of humane. Yeah. Don't you find it? Well, sex I think wardrobes scenes, people were hurt so in cross. the filming of that. Yeah. 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 I think wardrobes and furniture were were hurt in the filming of that scene. Yes. Were they not? Yes, they if were. Memory serves me correctly. Now, we're, what we're going to do is make you a little loose women for a couple of minutes because we're going to do a topic and get your thoughts on it. Oh, okay. Do, if you don't mind, this, yeah. this was, um, it's been in the papers today, basically. There's a, a journalist, her name is uh, Angela Epstein. And basically what she says she does is she turns on the waterworks to get what she wants. Doesn't mean she wheezes, it means she, she, she cries. <laughs> that would work. That yes. would work. It would, do you know if you don't that? give me what I want, I'll wheeze. <laughs> <laughs> I think that's brilliant. Do you think that's more powerful? That's a whole yeah. other topic. That's, <laughs> but that's really powerful because it's sort of anti-authoritarian. It and it's really, mm, anyway. Yeah. Yeah, but would, would you ever cry to get your own way? Well, I would hope not. I would hope not. Um, I think there's a, it's, it's difficult, isn't it, using your emotions to manipulate because mm. it's a little bit boy you cried wolf because then if yes. you cry for real, perhaps mm, there's mm. that. And I understand that we've had to be devious over the years of repression, which obviously continue in many parts of the world, and perhaps there I would cry. But um, we're here, and I would hope we'd have the confidence mm. to say uh, this is what I want yeah mm. instead of going this is what, what, I what want. do you think of people who do it what do you think of women who do it because you are a, a, a rampant feminist really aren't yes. you yeah. Yeah. <laughs> are you rampant Emma? I am I'm a rampant and <laughs> feminist sometimes <laughs> at the same time yes. what does it make you cross it makes me a little bit cross that that women do that to yeah. get their own way you know to cry in front of men to get off a parking ticket or whatever I mean would you do but that do they do they yes I mean, they I do just, do they have you seen well, them I no, I know what? someone who has. Oh, really? Someone who works on this show, didn't what? it? Did it work? I, yeah. yeah, it did, actually. Really? Well, I'd rather pay the ticket. <laughs> Absolutely, because I'm belligerent like yeah. that, and I can tell that you are too. So you don't want to do that to yourself, no. do you? Because do you in a what? sense, mm. it's self -harming. I don't want to go next isn't it? now. <laughs> you know, well, you I, I have to confess, I've grown out of it. Yes, but, but you did it when you were younger. I have done it. Yes. And I did it, well, I did it... In the early stages of relationships, when I was about 17 and I just thought, you know, if I had a little cry, he would probably see the error of his ways a bit more. It would have more impact because yes. I didn't mm. have the vocabulary to explain but, necessarily but did what you, I... Could you just could you just cry? I mean, I can't yeah, I really can, just cry, yeah. uh, except if I'm acting... Well, that doesn't really make sense, does it? Because, of course, I can just cry. Yeah. But, I mean, in, in yeah. real life... Well, you're pretending to be someone else, else then. So that's I, did it, exactly. I did it as a kid as well. I remember when I was doing... Um, I did, we did Annie the Musical when I was 14, and the leading actress was going back to America, and all the other orphans were crying because she was going. I couldn't stand her. <laughs> <laughs> and I felt left out because all the other kids were crying. So we're all in the huddle, and they were all crying. I was poking myself in my eyes. <laughs>
about to make myself cry, so I, I thought, I'm so hard. <laughs> did, did the other girls actually like her, though? Or were they, they think, actually turning it on? Because if you didn't oh, like her, there's a chance that they probably didn't like maybe. her. They were perhaps oh, being better actresses, false you and you were that's, being honest. That is maybe. stage school girls for you. Yeah, uh, absolutely. Yeah. I don't yeah. do it now, though. I don't believe Good. in crying. I just My daughter's grown out of that as well, but she's mm. five. Have <laughs> <laughs> you just written a screenplay of yes. that? Have you just written a screenplay? Of Annie? Yeah. Yes. Yes, I have. Yes. Yes. They, they're doing a new one with Willow Smith playing Annie That's and Jay-Z. <gasps> The oh music did it. Yeah. yeah. Oh my goodness. Wow, well, you're right down with the kids. You, you finished I it. Am. I'm yeah. so modern. You're going to rap. Just can't you're going to probably myself. rap. The sun will come out tomorrow. <laughs> yes. 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 Well, he did a rap version of <laughs> it's, it's a hard not life. life. Oh, of course he oh, did. So yeah. it's, it's all sort of going to be so same songs. Modern, with the kids. modern music. Yeah. Same songs. Yes, same songs. Although there's a couple of new ones because I've turned. Do you remember in it? There's that. Slight pill of a character, Grace, who's looking after Annie, and then yeah, they get together. The and I always thought that was a little bit too convenient. So Grace is now a Latin American gay man called Manolo. Right. Yeah. Well, Emma, I'm, you may not have any rapping, but I'm going to have to wrap you now because we are finished. You've been a delight. Thanks. It's Emma Thompson, everyone. Thank you.